Andy here, and I know a lot of you have been having trouble with OBS 32 and like just plugins not working and when you're updating it. So I want to help you in this video with the Elgato Stream Deck plugin as a lot of people have been struggling if they're using something like portable mode uh, OBS, they can't update Stream Deck and stuff like that. So I'm here to help you out with that one. Uh, for anything else... Uh, you can make sure you use the StreamUp plugin and that'll check whether or not you need plugin updates and stuff like that. So it makes it a lot easier for you. That's a free plugin that I made. And uh, basically, as you can see here, I don't have the Elgato Stream Deck at all. And I'm using portable mode because I use it all the time. So the way that we basically need to go and grab this file is in your program data folder, okay? So you get to it by going down to the win search here and typing percent sign program data uh, percent sign like so. Mine keeps glitching out a little bit and won't let me open it from here. So to get to it from uh, say you're on, on your desktop or something like that, you want to go to your C drive, your main drive, and you will need to show hidden folders potentially, uh, but you'll be able to see program data. So not program files, program data is the one that you want. And if you're not seeing it there, you need to make sure you just show hidden files. So a cheeky brief interception, interception, something like that. If you want to uh, show hidden files, you just go to um, press this little ellipsis just here, press options, and this will bring up this menu, press view, and you can press show hidden files. And that will show you that hidden file of program data in your C drive. So when I go to C drive now, you can't see it. But if I go press this, press options, then you'll be able to see if I go to view, show hidden folder, apply, press OK, and you'll be able to see, I can see the program data file just there. So we open program data just here, and we go down to OBS-Studio. It is one of, this is one of those things where I do wish um, that Elgato would just supply the plugin separately as normal, but they don't. Um, so you got OBS-Studio, Plugins, Stream Deck Plugin, and you've got two folders in here. We've got the bin folder, um, and then 64-bit, and you've got two files there. We're gonna copy these two files. We're gonna go to wherever your OBS is. So I've got mine here that says OBS No Plugins, it's called, and we're gonna paste this into our OBS Plugins file in 64-bit and paste them directly into there. That's that one. Then we'll go back to your main OBS folder. And then back in the uh, where you got the, the original Stream Deck plugin from, we'll go back to the data folder now. So you're, you're in program data, OBS-Studio, plugins, Stream Deck plugin, data. And we're going to copy all of these files. So copy them all. And then we'll go to, to your OBS that you want to install them to. And we're going to go into data. We're going to go to OBS plugins. And what you need to do is create a new folder. So this folder needs to be Stream Deck Plugin. It needs to be exactly like that, same capitalization. So capital S, Stream, capital D, Deck, capital P, Plugin. All exactly the same, and you're just going to paste them directly into there. And then once we've done that, we can open up OBS. So Bearing in mind, this tutorial is uh, taking into account that you've already updated your Stream Deck software, which obviously you guys always stay up to date, right? But as you can see, I now have the Elgato Stream Deck just there. And you can see we're on version 5.5.4.2. Uh, if you're not kind of getting that right and you've not got them same files as me, what you might need to do is go down to your Stream Deck software and just make sure you're up to date. So you just right click, check for updates, and it'll tell you that you're up to date or not. I mean, I'm not even up to date. Damn. But as long as you're on, uh, I think it's Stream Deck 7, that's what made all this work. Hopefully this video has helped you out. If it has, please share it with other people and also subscribe because i got loads of tips like this, including all the cool stuff like my OBS plugin, the Stream Up plugin. There's loads of cool stuff coming out soon, so make sure you do have a little wander around the channel. Come and visit me live at Twitch where we have just recorded this video. Put your rock over the stone.